how does this all, I mean, just reliving what I'm saying, and I apologize for saying it, but how, how do you feel just hearing me, you know, talk about it? Definitely brings back memories. Um, I think my brain kind of tries to save myself and block those memories at one point. So kind of like revisiting this is kind of like, yeah, that's right. That happened. Right. And, uh, actually the hand is, it was a minor thing. Uh, when I went to the hospital, they were checking my head first of all, cause, um, I have, uh, I have so many fractures in my skull. I mean, I was paralyzed. I couldn't see, I mean, um, my hearing was off. Um, my eyes, everything, just, you know, completely, like, I was so bad, actually, my family, who knew about this, flew my mother from our home country, because they thought I was going to end there, and they flew that night, um, because she wanted to say goodbye, and I, they really, everybody who saw me there didn't think I was going to make it, it was very, very, um, you know, that was the most impact thing that has happened to my family. And it's weird because I was a safe motorcycle because you always hear those crash rockets. Oh, man. Yeah. You know, I've been 150 miles per hour on the, on the freeway. I was like, nope, that's not going to be me. I'm wearing a full face helmet. I'm having the jacket. I have the gloves. I even went to training, even though I have, you know, I rode motorcycles before. I wanted to be legit. You know, I wanted to have everything in order. And um, and then here I am, you know, on the bottom of a bus uh with uh distract the driver and i did everything i could for my point and then i ended up having all this because distracted driving